Well, here we are on Saturday. And what Mrs. P has got for tea is steak. There is a steak under there. I promise you. See? There's a steak under there. So we have got steak, onions, mushrooms, peppers, Jersey raw potatoes and carrots. I just really fancied a bit of steak, so that's what we've got. So what Mrs. P has got for tea on Saturday. Steak, Jersey Royals, carrots. And the steak's garnished with onions, peppers and mushrooms. Lovely. Well, here we are on Sunday. Mr P's at work, so I'm on my own. So I thought, do you know what? I'm going to have small paddock with, I just ha uh, cut up three little um, Jersey Royal potatoes. I've got peas and carrots. Mr P cannot stand the, the smell of smelly fish, but I love it, so... What Mrs. P has got for tea on Sunday. Smoked haddock with Jersey Royal potatoes, peas and carrots. And I'm going to enjoy every mouthful of it. And here we are on Tuesday. And what Mrs. P is having, although it's dinner time, not tea time, so lunch time. I'm having um, carnation chicken with salad. I'm trying to eat the bulk of my food earlier in the day to stop me getting indigestion. So what Mrs. P has got for tea on Tuesday, salad with coronation chicken. And it smells absolutely delicious. I'm welcome back to Mrs. P what is for tea and we are Wednesday. So I have taken out a butter chicken with um, vegetable rice. And I've just, I took that out last night and it's been in the microwave and I've done some garlic bread. So what Mrs. P has got for tea on Wednesday is butter chicken with vegetable rice and garlic bread. It smells absolutely delicious. Well, here we are on Thursday. And you know, I just fancied a Cornish pasty with beans. So I stopped into the co-op and I got a Cornish pasty and I'd got beans. So what Mrs. P has got for tea on Thursday Cornish pasty and beans and that rounds up the meals of the week for this week so thank you so much for joining me I'd love you to click the subscribe button and join the family and we'll be back on Monday with a shopping haul thank you so much